my god, is this shit lagging? I was just gonna pull out some quick tarot cards for Scorpio, Cancer, and Pisces. Look at this neat thing I got. I think this is super cool. This is a hematite. I think this is cute. Ain't this cute, this hematite? Can anyone hear me? Okay. Um, I don't know what's the name of this deck. Sorry if I seem awkward. I'm gonna pull out three cards for cancer. Cancer, you have the magician. Either you're really focused on something or you're really manifesting something positive or negative in your life through your experiences because of your emotions. Or maybe you just study witchcraft. You have the judgment card. Either you judging yourself or you're judging someone or there's some type of karmic thing happening to you. Good karma, bad karma. Or maybe you're reconnecting to a person, place, or a thing. Judge me. Let's put out your third card. All these cards are I just need a one card. Are you... Is there a cancer having family problems? Are you having family problems or like... At home? Are you helping a family member because they have money problems? Is someone moving back into your home or you're moving back into someone else's home, Cancer? What is Cancer focusing on? Yeah, I'm a man. I'm not a transgender. I'm a man. I'm gay. It's a wig. Cancer, I think you have an incredible intuition or you're discovering new things about yourself and people around you. 
I also feel like you're focusing on a lot of memories from your childhood or your past. All right, those were the three cards I pulled out for Cancer. I'm gonna do Scorpio. Are you depressed? Are you feeling sorry for yourself? Or are you missing something that you lost? Let's pull out two more cards for you, Scorpio. Because cups represents feelings and emotion. Five is like chaotic conflicted feeling energy it's like you're mourning these feelings thank you for the likes you have the page of pentacles it's like your your health or your money has been on your mind. Maybe you've been talking about money or someone's been using money very immaturely. I feel like I feel like Scorpion, I feel like Scorpion, sorry, I feel like Scorpion, um, you have like a lot of heavy burdens, like you put too much on your plate. And wands represent actions and movements so these movements or actions have been making you feel like you're in a burden or burdensome. Scorpio, or you're probably letting go of a lot of heavy burdens because you've been feeling very obligated to things and you don't want to feel obligated to everything. Does that make sense? Let me ask, let me ask, hi, let me ask, what is this depression, five of cups feeling for Scorpion? I feel like you're moving on from this depression. I don't feel like you're stuck in depression. I feel like you moved on. Scorpion. Whatever you was depressed about, whatever self-pity or uh, dep depression feelings that you had, you're moving on from those feelings because six of swords. Swords is to think or talk. And have you been thinking or talking about you moving on? And you're not depressed or feeling depressed or longing for that energy. I feel like the reason why you have the nine of wands is because you're going through some type of recovery from health or broken heart. Scorpion. Let's ask about Scorpion money. Money on your mind.
Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> Why is money in Scorpio mind? Thank you for um, sharing your truth. Oh, a lot of you have mental clarity. Some of you could be starting a new job. New job. New job. Interesting, Scorpion. Let's do Pisces. Should we do Pisces? Is it Pisces men, women, gay, straight, bi? Should we do Pisces? Pisces, you're thinking about the future. You're thinking ahead, like 10 steps ahead, Pisces. Also, you're hoping and wishing for the best. But I feel like you're going to have surprise friendships, Pisces. Surprise, you make new friends. You also have seven of swords. Either you're good at keeping secrets. Or someone is keeping secrets from you, Pisces. Maybe sneaky, or maybe they just don't want to tell everybody their business because it's no one's business. And they have every right to do that. I don't have to tell everybody why I have a chip tooth because it's no one's business. The social media. Social media. People take it too personal. Page of Wands. Either you're talking to someone who's very immature with the actions, Pisces. Hopefully this is your child and not an adult acting like a child. Let's see why they act like that. Oh, this is not a family member or a friend. This is more like a romantic partner. And they're being immature with their actions. What are you hoping for the future, Pisces? Queen of Swords, the Empress. Either you're hoping that you have some type of woman empowerment or something, or maybe this is your mother or your baby mother. Maybe you have a woman or a family helping you in the future. And maybe she's a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Pisces. Let's pull out one more card. Two of Swords. Libra energy. Maybe you're feeling indecisive about cutting a woman out of your life. And it's hard for you to make a decision to cut this woman out of your life. Maybe that's what it is. There's a woman... Pisces, you don't want them in your life no more. <sighs> All right, guys. This was super cool. Thank you.